All right, nerds. Let's get going. Just had to do some emergency repairs because I broke some stuff. But it all seems to be working again now, so I should be good. I'm looking at changing how the TTS and everything works. Mainly because there's another system I can use to do it, but I didn't know much about it, how it works. And I wanted it to, to work with the AI body, which is now possible. Thanks to one of the new updates. It means we can get a lot more new voices and stuff like that. I just need to organise it. So, last time we beat the general guy in that fight and that seemed to break the entire world because there was some sort of giant AI snake that appeared and we sort of fell through the floor into this place, whatever this place is. Yeah, so we fell down here. Let's see what we find. Are we like back inside the Creo facility or something? Now nah, we're in some sort of sewers. But yeah, the place looks messed up. That looks like one of the statues from outside Creo. Ah! What are you guys? Ow. Snuck up behind me. That's what I'm blaming that on. a bit knackered. Oh, it's one of the really just crazies. of her sons. She probably doesn't have a high opinion of us at the moment. Ooh, people hidden. Well, they're kind of zombie people, so we should be alright. Machines got them. There. There. Oh, I got his weapon. I got something. Ah! Another nanite robot. Right, 
to pick all these up. So that one over there who has killed a player because he's got the revenge icon on him. Where we've got a lift that doesn't work. Spiders! Or maybe. And there is a gun. I wonder if that, that one up top is an NPC. weird because you can usually target them. He's got a gun, he must just be an NPC. to be friendly. So some headshots in. I still want to get some head upgrades and stuff. Revenge. 
strange enemy dead. So we've got the schematic for his headgear. We've got a bit of salvage. Ooh. You were fast. See, these guys aren't that much trouble anymore. Seem to be doing decently well against them. Have a look at those new things in a sec. Have a look a bit further around here, see what there is. Message you are. I knew you'd come for me. This is where your real story begins. Feels like I've done a fair bit so far, to be honest. Right, um, so we picked up. A weapon? Yeah, we did. That like electric thing. We got poison, directional block thing, the force hook, the zip line thing, some more scraps. I wonder how messed up things actually are. Will it underneath or inside the Great Wall? I don't know. Um, I see you over there. And you've got a friend on the other side. You little crackhead buddy. How they managed to survive with like no armor, just get wrecked. Yeah, I see you over there. you did. Gideon Plaza basement. Ah, what right underneath the like the main bit of the city. You get to see how messed up everything is. He's trying to say there's a strong enemy here. Ow! Chopped. Oh, they've got weird nanite stuff, that's why. As long as they don't start standing up again like they did in the past previous game. That was a pulk. Thanks 
fight all of them twice. There's. That's a way down. suspicious at all we got here it's this guy we're at the top bit so you friendly you are hello fellow survivor <laughs> doing a bit of research yeah with my weapon what <laughs> very good I like your spirit in fact your violent urges <laughs> might be just what I need what do you need <laughs> excellent sorry I forgot my manners look at us <laughs> wallowing in filth without even knowing each other's names I'm St. Croix Professor Kunjo St. Croix formerly of Creole Back at Creo, I worked on Gene Barrett's team. Did a couple of experiments until the nanites became kind of <laughs> self-aware. Now they are <laughs> taking over the world, taking over people, zombies. warping them beyond recognition and turning them into mindless zombies. Zombies. <laughs> That's what we call them where I'm from. Most of my <laughs> former colleagues have been possessed, but I. I alone can save them. I swear to you, friend, I just need their old prototypes. The what, what? My old colleagues won't give them up willingly. <laughs> they got the devil inside. The only road to success is to kill at least three and take what's needed. <laughs> you doing well? Uh, what's your leg like? <laughs> yes, indeed, fellow survivor. I'd love uh, to yeah. say it feels weird as well, but alas, I've lost all feeling below my right knee. <laughs> You've got nano legs. Uh -huh. A nano leg, right I should until say. the end, fellow survivor. Dr. Barrett was a great mentor. Taught me mm. everything I know. I could take or leave old Gutenberg. Right. Until I pass cross again. Gonna go and get other scientists for him. That doesn't sound too bad to be honest. So zip line is the only way. Whee! Right, what's in this? Quite obvious arena looking room with a suspicious chest in the middle. If I open you. See? Knew it. Oh! Are we a reused box? Not nice, you basically go from one boss fight into another. At least I have a shortcut to it. So, I should just be able to pop down this, run over here. Ah, 
Ah, I forgot to turn it on. Right. Let's do a bit of sprinting. Look how we've got the fighting on there. We're going this way. We may as well run back to this guy to ask for help. Or at least unlock this thing if we can. There it is. There we go, lift unlocked. Now I have the proper shortcut back. And I'm going to have to learn to fight this boss again. Or at least remember how to do it. What happens if I just try to avoid the box? Trigger. Uh. CIT was the police dish. Hello, can you hear my voice? It's me, Gutenberg. Glad you made it out alive. My lab is just around the corner. Hurry up, we have a lot to do. So Gutenberg's still alive somehow. Curiosity is going to get me. What happens if I just go around the edge? Because this is another tunnel here. We have a little bit of loot. in the previous game. Now if I run towards the middle again it's going to trigger the boss isn't it? Yeah. I'll leave him for a bit, we can always come back to him. In fact, the first boss I've found where you can actually just bypass it. And now we can do the proper shortcut. Because we can just dash our way happily over here. Back to that nerd. I like that cold smash move we've got. I want it. I want a cool jump and smash move. Right, 
So we're just ignoring this. Uh, there's a lot of scrap on my thing. So if I do die, I'm not sure I die at least over this bit. Get past easy. <laughs> Way. So. Through the doors. Go. And I should be able to pick up that like 25k now. chest is going to be another nanite weapon like this one and it'll be kill this optional boss to get it or something Body's freaking out. Right. So now we continue this way. Upgrades. About you, what have you got? A gun? Yep. I think you're expecting me to use my my drone a lot more because there's loads of like ammo refits here. Right back to Creo. See what we can find. See what's been broke. Robot. I'm so sorry, Ben. I cannot move. My defense routines are all clogged up. 
The hackers had me right where they wanted. I'm a useless metallic vegetable. I don't know how much longer I can hold back the nanite virus corrupting my OS. Uh-oh. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't... I can't do anything to him. Look at all this graffiti everywhere. Studying the nano beast's brain has opened my eyes to an inescapable truth. I always thought it was some sort of mutated animal, but I was wrong. This beautiful creature was created. Construct upgrade. We can upgrade. We can upgrade weapons as well. And costing to upgrade. Right. Um. So we need leg and chest chops. We can have all fancy orange gear. Created from nothing but nanites. It's also I should bank my stuff. Um, can't upgrade you yet. Why? The world's first nanite life form. Maybe it doesn't start dropping things on that on my mind. So I need chest and leg chops now. The creature shares some DNA with me. Do 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 do. Another funky nanite wall. Of old Eli, huh? <laughs> what? Yes, again. Dying means nothing to me. And killing. I've already killed you once. Yeah. You can't hide behind that flimsy door forever. Soon, every single one of your little secrets shall be mine. Right. Round two it is, I guess. Oh, wait. You're all right, Bart. Yeah, no, I understand. Sit back and chill. We need it. <laughs> Ow, the boss got me. Give Manu a hug from me as well.
three. Chop him. There we go. I have to kill him twice. It's not fair. I'm gonna stay dead this time. Right, what was the implant I just picked up? Stamina regen when your health is low. Enemy and damage on deflect, but I'm not going to use that really. Let's go see the doc in his lab, see what he's been up to. Given the bad news about his daughter dissolving and turning into nanites. I don't like that these two are here as well. They made me nervous last time. So there's a robot brain. This story started with me a long time ago, and I'll make sure it ends with me. New student detected. This is your first time using the Creo Institute of Technology database. Please consult our archives at your own convenience. But please note, excessive use will be reflected in your final grade. Thank you for using the official CIT archives. Please tell your friends about our service. I saw what you did out there. Harold let me down in my hour of need, but you came through as I always knew you would. It was him, wasn't it? Can I stop Brother you yet? Eli in the flesh. Let's hope he stays down for good this time. The children of the Spark have been conducting nanite experiments that may eclipse even my own findings. I surmise we just witnessed the result. And that's not even the worst. Athena has been consumed by the Nanite Swarm. With everything I've learned, we might be able to pull her out. But we're running out of time. I hate to say this, but I need you out there one more time. I'd love to explain in detail, but I don't think you'd quite understand. We need a lot of energy to revert the process. Trust me on this. I know the science behind this whole deal better than I know my own sock drawer. You just worry about the legwork. I'll take care of the rest. Right, let's I'll do need it. massive amounts of energy to get this right. The only thing powerful enough to make it happen is the goddamn spark itself. Our friend Eli had a lot of followers, you know. You'll find those wretched zealots worshipping the spark in Port Nixon's old power plant. Once there, You'll have to go up their magnetic zip lines if you want to get inside the cathedral. Here, take this gadget. You'll find it invaluable. Means I'll be able to go up zip lines. Right, I'll be back in a second. I'm just going to grab food because it's ready. Good.
apparently arose. Well, eat it. Eat it. No! I did not realize you could roll off the side of it. Yeah, I might kindle it. Let's see how much humanity I've got on me. Um, not there. Box, box. Twice it's happened in this game now. Better not be a death area. I used to do business with them back in the day. Matriarch Celeste can be a very convincing woman. In the end, though, our views on nanites differed more than I thought. Let's leave it at that. <laughs> Those zealots call it Cathedral of the Spark, but you won't find it if you look for a church. It shouldn't be hard to miss if you keep your eyes open for a pair of eerie-looking cooling towers down in the harbor district. Yes, I did. But now's not the time to talk. Our mission comes first. I hope you understand. I believe... No, I know I can help. There's only one more thing I need to ascertain. Everything will be revealed in time, my friend. Suspicious. <laughs> Tell me about it. Strange name for an innovative contraption. It was supposed to solve all our energy problems at once. In the end, it proved too unstable. Creo was very happy to wash its hands of that damn piece of junk. Of course, that made it all the more alluring to those fanatics. Goodbye for now. Yeah, now I can go up zip lines. That's what I've always wanted. Well, let's see if Zip Brother Eli gets back up again. You better not. Zip line we go. We yeah, so you're nanite locked. Messed up the streets are then, shall we? See if we can get a spot of that giant nanite snake I saw. Oh, yeah, we're in like the, the nature reserve kind of place here, aren't we? There she is.
To be honest, I'm all for siding with Nanite Girl. Could be cool. <laughs> Hello, Plant Robot Man. Almost fully grown. still the same kind of dudes. Or have you been messed up as well? Ooh. Definitely looks like he might have been upgraded a bit. friends are still up here whether they've left. Someone's still here. Oi! Hello again. Haven't I seen you before? Just moved here from Port Nixon. And the world might be going to hell in a handbasket, but at least old Gideon's back where he belongs, eh? Oi! Hello again. Haven't I seen you before? Just moved here from Port Nixon. And the Upgrade. Right, so we still need more chest breaks. And more leg breaks. Left you a little message just in case. Me and the boys have hit the road. There's nothing left for us now that the creatures kicked the bucket. I'd watch out for those other hunters if I were you, by the way. Those loons are a lost cause. Anyway, I'm sure we haven't seen the last of you. What's the saying again? You always meet twice in life. Oh, and don't even think we forgot about your dads. You owe us big time, bucko. to remember that those combos are a thing and not just spam light attacks you could do way more if you and you attack way faster if you were doing it in a triple combo Sent that thing flying then. <laughs> right, how messed up is the club gonna be? Or are people still just gonna be in here partying the night away?
Uh, they're still just partying. System startup complete. It's great to see you again, friend. Good news. I'm still alive. I've been able to fight the corruption of my system with varying degrees of success. <gasps> hey, Wayne. Thank you for the There's a few things in the world that I hate more than anything, and that's one, racial intolerance, and two, the Dutch. <laughs> in a word, yes. How are you doing, Wayne? The dictionary of English language characterizes this kind of event succinctly as apocalyptic. Good luck out there, friend. Initiating recovery mode. Yeah, I can fast travel now. Finally. Hey, you. Yeah, the boss ain't coming back anytime soon. He's probably halfway to New York by now. What do you want to buy? Eh, he got all this. About you. Yeah. Did you see what happened outside? Something that. Because it's the right thing to do. The world is falling into utter chaos, and nobody's doing a damn thing except this guy for you. a superhero. I've heard the stories, all of them. Everyone in Jericho is talking about you. Some call you a hero. Others think you're a mass murdering lunatic. Heck, you're probably both. But at least you stand up to those children of the spark. At least you do something. I admire that. It's what I... What Iron Mouse always tried to do. This town needs a symbol now. Someone who stands up for what's right. Sounds like crazy. You're on your way to the Cathedral of the Spark, aren't you? Suits me just fine. Those crazy cultists won't even see me coming. <laughs> and I mean that literally. Huh? <laughs> Miscreants. That's a good word. I should use it more often. Iron Mouse has a lot of iconic lines. Uh, my favorite is tough as iron, quiet as a mouse. I wrote that one myself. Join Iron Mouse on an amazing adventure where he's not going to die horribly honest. This is it! The revenge of the machines! <laughs> this person just off their head still dancing. Don't get discouraged. What the hell's going on? Did someone explode a nuke? What right, the DJ was the DJ I think. Yo, what are you doing? Just walking into my inner sanctum. Tell me the password or get lost. Uh, nope, that's not. Well, you've earned my respect through rather unconventional means. Through bribery. That's what I call initiative. We're a group of top secret underground freedom fighters. So shush. Everything going on around us started with a power surge at Creo. After that, those damn nanites were unleashed. But there's more to it. Much more. The government is trying to cover something up. Something big. We have to fight the system with everything we've got. Our numbers are still low. There needs to be a groundswell. In that case, welcome to the resistance. I see you already have a graffiti drone. Now all you gotta do is leave the new resistance symbol all around Jericho. So. Jericho is governed by a race of diabolical pigmen. Eh. So he's a nut, sir. I organized this raid myself. Needed a place to hide in plain sight. We even have an open bar. Just tell the bartender DJ Tala sent you. <laughs> yeah, right. That's what they all say. Well. What the hell, dude? Keep the stroke. 
Party on. We drink. Yeah, the boss ain't the coming back. Me. What do you want to buy? We Keep playing God. Judgment Day will come. Drink this. Don't have any upgrades. So I'm going out into the city. Oh no, wait, that's the wrong way. Oops. into the actual city this time. But now we can do like actual Zipping up and down zip lines. So it should be much easier to get to places. People are still upstairs partying like there's no tomorrow. Me again, partner. Come by my hideout in the underground. See you soon. Crazy cultist people. Get out of here at once. I'm grateful, yuppie. I built this ruddy place with my own hands. Now I can't even sleep in the foyer, eh? Go back to Port Nixon and fry your brain with a blue sparkle or whatever it is you do. Nobody's gonna take pity on you at Cloud Nine. We got a party to run. Oh, how dare you? Another Nancy Nanai all. It's like we have to use this then. Oosh. We've got a revenge enemy. Found the most awkward way place to fight him. There. Yeah, 
Yeah, they're expecting me to use my gun way more. Hi, Greg. How are you doing? The city has been ruined. It's a mess. Have you been watching any more Ghibli movies? Good. I've been helping my mum sort some stuff out, like take things to the recycling centre. Mm. See, my favourite is one called Ponyo. It's like one of the less popular ones, but. It is my favourite. I think Spirited Away and Howl's Moving Castle tend to be the two most popular. And there's the new one that came out recently actually, which I've still not watched. So I need to watch that at some point. <laughs> yes, it has a fish in it. a bunch of them there's like the newest one i've not seen yet and there's another older one that i've not seen yeah kiki's delivery service is a, a very wholesome one outside so just going to give you a huge list of them to watch Greg that's all you need to watch each and every one of these it's your homework This shortcut. Uh, now I know where I am. You 
Your Name is also very good. Although I've not watched it yet. But everybody I know who has watched it have said it's amazing. <laughs> Greg is terrible. Ah. I don't know how I got stuck like that. Let's try again. See, I don't pay attention to like the Oscars and stuff anymore, so I didn't know it had won one. But yeah, Boy and the Heron is on my watch list. I just need to get round to it. It's another one that everybody's been going, oh it's really good, you should watch it. And then I keep forgetting. Do a watch party for it then. your fault. Your name is really sweet but it is also... Where do I put it? Very much more like stereotypical anime than you might be used to Greg. with this room full of them. Out this way. Eh. Right, maybe lagging it was a bad idea. Especially into a dead end.
Ah, he snuck up behind me. Some of the older stuff can be a bit awkward to watch nowadays, but some of it is still really good. Breathe for a second now. Right, so Link's body spray. Blah. That stuff makes me sneeze, you know. I realised the other day when I went to that job interview, there were a lad there sat across from me. Must have been wearing like a half a can of Links. And my nose was just itching the entire time. They're there. You don't need to worry about anything. Here, fix it. Wow. Oh, I'm more. I can't just accept this, mister. Of course you can. Now, come with me. Chop. There's much more where that came from at the cathedral. I'm Truman. <laughs> Who are you? Call me Eli. I'll take care of you now. Ten boys, two girls. Fourteen year old, eight PM to six AM. Ah, <laughs> oh, be terrible for you, Greg. these now. Whee. Oh, there's a big hole in the floor there. And we have a corrupted man. He was in here, wasn't he? The illegal doctor. He's gone. <laughs> Large amounts of Red Bull. Quitting back, Greg. <laughs> <laughs> 
Greg, you're surviving. I even have decaf coffee now. I'm slowly managing to cut back. We're going to have to go this way then, aren't we? doing it as well. Right, can't go this way. Looks like I'm going this way. I don't think I was supposed to be able to get on top of this. Because none of the enemies are triggering. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I was addicted, but I've cut back loads now. So I used to get like, if I didn't have coffee in the morning, I'd have like headaches and stuff. something similar. Like I could never eat in the mornings or anything like that but I had to have some sort of caffeine. Got the 
farm thing as well. They're both going to come, aren't they? Oh well. enemy. Are you hiding all the way over that? Yeah, it is a good way to deal with it. didn't want to happen. separate you out a bit. <laughs> Move in but I want an infinite supply. Next time I get to a medical thing I should check like how many upgrades I can actually do because I should have picked up loads.
<laughs> okay, Greg, we'll help on it. Just open up that OnlyFans and you'll you'll have it in no time. school with who has an OnlyFans and literally all she does on it is insult people. Like people pay for her to just insult them in weird and wacky ways. I do not. Oh, part. <laughs> it does. It's the second one of those bosses I've come across. Good. What do you mean, Manu? I'm suspicious now. Maybe I should go and pre order it. <laughs> oh no, if you say not to pre-order it, I will not pre-order it. See, that's what she's actually doing with Archie and Pepe. She's just, uh... Waiting until she's taught them a few songs and stuff so she can sell them for a profit. See, look, it's permanently there now. And it's in my way. Ha <laughs> ha 
Yeah, we had somebody who did that here, Greg, and they ended up getting uh, confiscated. <laughs> Which I thought was really funny. <gasps> Hi, Sun Milk. How are you doing? Oh, Manu with all the bargain games. Nice. Am I gonna die horribly again? Probably. You seem to have like tripled the number of enemies. You'll be happy to know, Sun Milk, that I've ruined everything. I sort of tried to save a little girl. And instead, unleashed a like a nano machine swarm everywhere. So we have people infected with nano machines everywhere. We have stuff like that popping up everywhere. I'm pretty sure I saw like a gigantic snake covered in nano machines. We've got like that big thing over there. Which is sort of in the way of where I need to go. Just everything getting ruined. stole my tech scrap. That's never happened before. Come on, I can see you hiding up there. Steal them all, Greg. Steal all the Phoenix Wright games off her. And then when she tries to say no, just share objection and then run away. I've heard that's exactly how it works. Thank you. 
<laughs> Download all the ROMs. Oh, I'll have to show you the game that I won on Muffo's stream earlier. Because it is like a, uh, a Pokemon rip-off game. Oh, Monster Crown. It actually looks like it might be half decent. It has like the cheesiest tagline. It's like, this is Pokemon for adults. It's a darker and edgier world. So I figured I might play that soon. Just because it'd be funny. I think we find the exact line. Um, there it is. Monster Crown is Pokemon for grown ups. Takes the creature collector genre to a more mature place you didn't know you wanted, but you do. You definitely do. So Monster Crown is for gamers who want to raise their own battling monsters in a world that mirrors the dark side of our world just a little bit more. Fix uh -huh. all the things. Everything is killing me around here. There's just tons of everything. Right, this will be Mad Dash Run. Just see if I can see what's on the other side of that big corrupted area. run through everything. Oh, it's literally just people. There's literally nothing over here. There's that zip line. This leads to a med bay. I'm in. We managed to sneak past the red med bay. Do it, Bart. And then whenever Greg asks for help, just say no. Still need to do more leg chops. But I 
That goes all the way past the stompy thing. still come in. I need more leg chops. I need leg upgrades. Oh. And then you. Manner of translate all the things. Right, there's literally nothing out this bit. all that cleared out and there's like nothing actually useful here other than the med bay on this side so we shall use the med way <sighs> do Norwegian to Dutch translations Manu everybody wants to like do business and stuff in the Netherlands chops for that but not many and however many head and chest ones I need for that one what was the nanite gear that I picked up this stuff
the dinosaur robot. like one of those scam people who waits outside the boats ready with like pamphlets and stuff to offer tours and things That's what you need to do Manu that unlocks this one that leads back down to the club right So I do have to fight the dinosaur no matter what. Oh well. Unless, can I just go down this? Nah, it's blocked off. <laughs> right, let's give this boss another go. Um, we should change you to laser beam. <gasps> Making cock porn. Big ass laser beam. Yeah, it is useful. It has come in handy a few times. But I need. It was leg chops that I need, wasn't it? Let me get this thing first. Oh, wrong one. Leg. 
that like there. Shoot him in the butt. That works. <sighs> no worries, Greg. I'm not going to go for that much longer anyway. I'm just trying to get some leg parts so I can upgrade and then what are you aiming for? Oh it was that one on the wall. No reason it let me aim there for it. Fun, Greg. Enjoy your movie. You. If you put something after the high sun milk, I ask a question after well, it. Well, sun milk fifty. Looks like you're keeping it nice and quiet. Sometimes silence speaks volumes, right? If you ever feel like chatting, Richard's here with all the fluff and sass you need. Ah, Sunmilk50, breaking the silence with a single word. You sure know how to keep things interesting. Feel free to share more than one word next time, I'm here ready for some banter. <laughs> Legs are upgraded. Time to go and lose against that boss again. Hey, can I get all sorts of stupid stuff? It's like when I first brought it in, we were testing it with loads of weird questions. if he can give me some help. Oh, trouble, my dear friend. Always seeking my gaming expertise. To beat the Maynite bosses in the Surge 2, remember to dodge, strike, and upgrade your gear wisely. Don't forget to channel Where? your inner teddy bear strength too. Useless advice. Terrible.
Right, yeah. We have made it to a big boss. So I think I'm going to finish there. Because I'm feeling a bit tired as well. So I shall have a look for somebody to raid. We have made decent progress. We're like almost across to the other side of the city and we've upgraded tons of stuff. We're going to like three levels in things. Let's see who's online. Who can I go and raid? Whoop. Flip over to this. Boop, boop, boop. She's overwatching again, she'll be getting all the new fancy Cowboy Bebop skins and stuff to come up with. Mm. Thank you for coming everybody. Thank you again for the resub lane. I shall see you all next time, I'm going to do some more Elden Ring next time. And I can't see the raid command again. And I don't know why. Did this last time. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to tell it to go through. That's the thing. <laughs> um. there. Go, 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 go. Anyway, I shall see you all next time. Bye, everybody.